If yesterday's game isn't a reason why the Houston Texans shouldn't hire Joe Brady ASAP, then I don't know what is. Yes, this game was absolutely horrible. The Houston Texans put up zero points. We haven't scored a touchdown in six quarters. And I was just thinking about how it's going to rag on this offense. You know, Tim Kelly should be fired immediately. Why David Kelly continues to stick for this guy I absolutely don't know why we have not seen a complete game called from Tim Kelly besides his one win against the Jacksonville Jaguars where they win against a first year head coach and uh, Trevor Lawrence's first game. Outside of that, we haven't produced a run game. We haven't produced a passing game. This offensive line hasn't done anything. Tyrod Taylor, outside of his six good quarters, hasn't done anything. Definitely should not be on this roster next year. This offense is that bad. And when someone like a Joe Brady, who you had strong connections to, he was almost hired last year as a head coach. The reason why he didn't, because of Deshaun Watson's uncertainty, um, I do even think he was on the plane when Nick Casario got hired. Everything was set in motion until the Deshaun situation went all the way left, and he said, let me just stay back in Carolina. Now, the Houston Texans are once again in a position where they have the worst offenses in the NFL. The ghost of Bill O'Brien is still here. You know when you hire Joe Brady, the potential for head coach is there. Is he going to be it right now? I don't think he's head coach ready. Why? If you look at his offense, you know, this year at Carolina, it hasn't been that good. Um... One of that, you know, there was a tweet that said that Matt Rule wanted to run the ball 30 times and Joe Brady wanted to throw the ball. So the head coach is obviously going to win the battle there. And, you know, and Joe Brady, unfortunately, was a casualty. But this guy is a great young offensive mind, 32 years old, has head coaching potential, you know, has the Sean McVay comparisons. Um, there's a lot of things you could definitely do with um, Joe Brady if you hire him. You know, you don't have to get rid of David Cully just yet. Tim Kelly should absolutely get the can. Should, you know, should have been fired yesterday as soon as the game ended. But if you look back at what Joe Brady has done, and I'll give you one of my famous quotes by him, right? He goes to LSU, has that phenomenal season with Joe Burrow, wins an award for, you know, assistant coach of the year, goes to Carolina. They have the 22nd ranked offense. When, Kish, when Christian McCaffrey was in the game, this offense looked damn near and, you know, unstoppable. Joe Brady has this quote where he said that, I want to make the defense defend every blade of grass that there is. I want to get my guys with speed and, and size into open space. That's what you want to hear from an offense coordinator, right? Some guy who is a creative mind and he's going to get things going. This is your potential head coach. And there's a lot of many ways you could play this. There's a lot of fans who already want to say, put him as head coach right now. I don't think that's in the best situation yet. Because there's still a chance the Houston Texans are bad next year. What if you're in a situation where, hey, you fired Tim Kelly, you sign him, Joe Brady ASAP. Hey, this is your new offensive coordinator and work on it. From now into the offseason, into next year, this is your head coach in waiting. We said it many times that David Cully is a bridge coach. He's definitely not the future. The Houston Texans, man, you had a chance to hire this guy last year. Go ahead and pull the trigger now. He's going to come into next season. You know, you have a fresh start. You have a brand new team. Him and Nick Casario are going to be on, you know, together. Um, hopefully David Cully will be on there, you know, you know, together as well. And if the Texans start off slow and if the Texans keep on losing, I'm sorry, David Cully, it's time to go. Hey, Joe Brady, you know, you are now the offensive court. I'm sorry. You are now the head coach of this team. That's what, that's how this story should end with Joe Brady evidently being the head coach for the Houston Texans for the upcoming years. All that stuff is possible. The, the the question is, is do the Houston Texans want to make a move like this? Do they want to start investing into their future right now by signing someone who a lot of people are going to be thinking is the next great offensive mind? Tim Kelly is so bad. Anyone out there can go and do a better job than him. 
Houston Texans, what are you waiting for? Go out there and get Joe Brady right now. This guy could be your future head coach. Let me know what you guys think. As always, go Texans. You guys have a blessed day.